Looks like Kled is the go-to. So that's locked in. And with that, we've got our compositions. Vici Gaming, are they taking a page out of Game Talent's book? They've got Flank from two sides. They've got Strong. Is playing towards the wall as you predicted. Swift shows up. Flash. Root color misses from Swift. They manage to get the slow. Can they burn down the Talia? They can. First Blood Sky. And set up by Swift. He's looping around, but Swift is already there. There's a lot of help that they need to burn through. Cocoon and Exhaust. He looks for oh, LWX who no. flashes back. Bengi follows up. He's going so deep for the kill, and he will get it. But they manage to get a dive from Sky, who teleports in, killing Caveman. And now they might try to catch Bengi. More he's got, and Bengi's dead. Wait, he's, he's still alive. And now he's dead. Bang, he's dead. <laughs> uh, a lot of time wasted, however, that Sky could have been going back up toward the top lane to catch that big wave. And Daisy is dropped. The slow is going to catch onto Shuan Chuan P. It's easy to bubble a target that's snared, but that's a late flash, plus a perfectly delayed knockup as Daisy has got that timing down. He doesn't have Equalizer just yet. There's a late teleport from Long. He's got Charge, and he's going to head immediately back in. Long executes. That kill immediately dives on to the second. We'll be able to reset aggro if he can get the kill here. The bubble misses. Long has got to get out of this. Flashes to safety. Hitbox was just barely off. Shuan Chuan P eats a, eats a headshot as Swift ganks bottom. And now Shuan Chuan P is, in fact, the one who is dead. LWX again spoon fed yet another kill. Bengi, though, is looking to gank Coco. He's ultimate, but he's also running out of time. The dragon is picked up by Newbie, but Long has engaged the fight. He's found Sky and more. They're going to kill one. That's going to be traded over for Bengi. As LWX is free firing onto these shots. Blade of the Rune King is doing work. He's turning now onto Long, who hops over the wall. More gets a slow. Coco joins the fight too late. Easy Hoon. Zanya stalls it out. Does he have enough? He finally will be able to kill Coco, but LWX is just firing shot after shot. Gets one, but will drop an answer. Drop an answer. Vici trade one for four. Right now, the question is, will Newbie fight afterwards? He's caught by the chain of corruption to despite yields and shields. He finally falls to Easy Hoon. They managed to catch LWX as well. A huge blunder from Newbie. Instead of leaving him for dead, they try to skirmish. And they trade two for one. But both junglers are dead. Vici, you can't immediately go to dead. And it looks like Newbie are just going to give away the Baron. Hello? Okay. On P. That's shield. Redemption means that Easy Hoon splits the fight. They're turning now on to more. That's the support. Chuan Chuan P gets one and forces the rest of Newbie back. They turn onto the inhibitor turret to break it down, but that's... It only took us 18 minutes longer than it should have. <laughs> but we're in the base. Finally, the inhibitor falls. They've already got a minion wave prepped down there as well. Long charges in to get Coco out. Dives in. They separate Swift. Meanwhile, they turn on to Sky. He's going to be able to kill Bengi as LWX is firing these shots across. That's a lot of damage the Phantom Dancer is doing. Long pulls him back in. Bear Trapper on a rope yanks him off the fountain, but he's able to heal up just enough. And LWX, the sole survivor, watches his base is crumbling to Vici. They're bringing in a minion wave here. Are they going to try to end the game? That's what I said. I said at best, their base would be destroyed. At worst, the game would end here just because of how devastating late it is and how easy it is for them to dive towers and to siege structures. Oh, man. Long is able to pop LWX. More dies as well. That is the ace as Vici Gaming turn onto the Nexus turret and end the match. Game number one, slow and steady, win the race goes to Vici Gaming. And relatively quite quick at a 33 minute victory, but it felt slower simply because Vici kind of lost their way halfway through that game. They couldn't quite decide, you know, where to sit. So just checking the stats right now, this is actually the first time we've seen Coco play Talia. He has never played it before. Yeah, so just the pressure of Easy Hoon kicks over. I like the fact that Long is also getting involved here. Ooh, gets the Electro Harpoon. They follow through. Heal is used. He sidesteps one, but Bangy gets first blood for Vici Gaming. And ultimately now the shoe is on the other foot. It looks so... Set up for success. A Weaver's Wall could totally pinch off Easy Bangy's, Bangy's right there, so he knows that he's got his other world Hello? champion right there. Shockwave finds Coco. A huge play, even buffering the collateral the way ping so bengi here comes the hero yeah dragon spawns and bengi's like not on my watch <laughs> i didn't get the red buff but Ooh. i'll get your varus forces a fight onto lwx tron tron p is taking a lot of damage there's a sustain tron tron p flash away oh wait you can't bengi shows up just in time to help execute the kill onto lwx caveman will be the one who gets it Finally, Swift shows up, but that's a one-for-one -one trade. Both 80 carries are dead. Easy Hoon shows up. Shockwave flings Coco back in. Excellent placement. Way over there as well, along with Schwan Chuan P. So 
Very safe play from Easy Hooney. Still eats the cocoon. Cleanse, can they burst him down? Caveman is trying to save him. Shockwave is enough for one. Swift follows and gets the kill, but that is a two for one trade. But the arrow connected and they were able to trade back effectively. Yes. Which also very well played. I mean, he burned both his summoners, but. He was able to get three. LWX forces a fight onto Schwan Schwan P. He's caught overextending without vision as lightnings. And they had Schwan Schwan P sort of fainting towards that side. Cocoon catches him. Dude, you've got Flash this time. Flashes the wall, follows it up, and dies. Flash the cocoon. To be fair, that was like max range, but they very well could lose this mid-tier one turret in the meanwhile. To as be that fair, newbie find a pick. He's a professional player. <laughs> he does this for a living. Bangy still finds good damage. Eats a cocoon of his own and that chains of corruption. What the damage, Bangy? Coco pins them all into the wall with a great weaver setup. Bangy follows up. Sky locks down Easy Hoon, knocks him away. He cleanses, still doesn't have flash. The shockwave is late, and Sky is trying to finish him off. Will not find enough. He dies to Bangy, who is outputting so much long. He's in the back line. He's been doing work the whole entire time. Gets another slow onto Coco and says, You will not escape me this time, Skywalker. Well, it should be noted that Swift is alive, but. Too little, too late. Vici take the single team fight in mid lane, rotate into a Baron. This guy. Has single-handedly broke open this game. Yeah. This guy is 4-0-3. Look at his itemization. He's got his... Uh, oh, uh, Weaver's Wall. They've caught Schwan Tron P. And Vici Gaming are like, fine, leave him. We'll just take it. <laughs> that moment when they observe more damage. So, Newbie, unfortunately, their power spike has fallen away. Gragas is no longer the big threat that he once was comparatively to his counterpart. Yeah. And oh, Michi are man. Like, Long is just burning Coco down. Flash auto from Easy Hoon. You want to fight? We have no problem fighting right now. Make there. it so difficult. Coco, I don't know if you want to be there. They have a wealth of options, though. So they either make the pick here. Oh, like that. That's the arrow we're looking for, Schwan Tron P. Bam. Doesn't even matter. One, four, and three. That Higher priority. Baron is locked down for Vici Gaming once again at the 31 minute mark. And they immediately make the rotation. Go and almost 1v2s. He's currently overheating. If he can get the burn, he can do a lot. He's standing on top, but the silence is not enough. It takes four members of Newbie to kill one. Of Task misses again from Sky. Schwan Tron P follows up. Flash. Flashes for it. Blade of the Ruined King gets the auto attack from max range. Another kill for Vici Gaming. Schwan Schwan P starting to make up for his. Uh... They could try to end the game right here. Five versus four. Swift is only just now going to respawn. Bengi is turning onto the Nexus turrets, turning onto the Nexus itself as he does huge damage. A cast knocks Vici right back in, but they are fine with that. LWX is trying to clean it up from the back and will get bursted down. Chuan Chuan P and Bangi are doing work. Long has turned onto the fountain, more dies. He turns onto Coco now as well. The ace from Newbie Gaming, from Newbie. And that means Vici Gaming take the set 2-0. They are in fourth place. And it was long that ended up with the triple kill in the end, but all eyes really should be on Bengi. That was his game from start to finish. He kicked it into gear starting with a box. Place your bets on more than 15 esports games. Deposit and withdraw easily using many worldwide payment methods. Place your bets live while enjoying the game. We offer 24 seven support, and bonuses for every new user. Bet now on arcanebet.com.